Welcome back to Zoomer Hall here in Liberty Village. We're live at Zoomer Radio, and uh, we're doing Frank's 100th birthday party here. ZoomerRadio.ca if you want to watch all of the goings on. Um, I want to bring someone to the stage right now who... I'm going to take you into the world of the tribute artist for a second. And over the years, I've met a lot of them. Um, I know one guy, for example, who when he opens his mouth, Billy Joel's voice comes out. It's just the way it is. He doesn't try to sound like Billy Joel. He just does. And so becoming a Billy Joel tribute artist was kind of a natural thing for him. As you've seen when we do the Collingwood Elvis Festival here with Zuma Radio every year, there are people who they either look like Elvis or they open their mouth and they sound like Elvis. And it's kind of unbelievable. We have a guy here who he opens his mouth. You'd swear that might be Frank coming out of there. And also what else is amazing about this guy for me especially as, as tribute artists go. For, for this guy, it is about the absolute unabashed love of the music and the man. So please, a round of applause, if you will. He's got a couple songs to cover for you. John Malcolm. Too hungry for dinner at eight. She likes the theater, but never comes late. And she'll never bother with people she hates. That's why the lady is a tramp. She don't like dice games with barons and earls. Won't go to Harlem Dressed in ermines and pearls Won't dish the dirt With the rest of those girls That is why the lady is a tramp She likes the cool, clear Wind in her hair Life without care She's broke, well that's oak Hates California Where it's cold and it's damp That is why the lady is a tramp Well, she gets too hungry For dinner at eight She enjoys the theater But never ever gets that late and she'll never bother with people that she hates. That is why the lady is a tramp. She don't like dice games with barons and earls. Will not go to Harlem dressed in ermines and pearls. Or will not dish the dirt with a red of the girls That is why the lady is a tramp She likes the free brisk A cool, cool wind in her hair Life without care She's flat But that's that Hates California Where it's cold and it's damp that is why the lady, that's why the lady, that's why the lady is a tramp. Yeah. Yeah. Lady is a tramp. I'm coming up to hassle you for a second. I'm going to hassle you in between songs for a second because I want to chat with you as a guy who, because... A lot of what we're, the others that we're going to be seeing tonight are going to be uh, singers that are performing with the band. And a lot of them are singers that are doing Sinatra covers as part of the overall picture of what they do. But you're the Sinatra guy. Talk to me about what it is about Frank that makes you do this. Well, first of all, I mean, being an entertainer, you know, you, you strive to be the best you can. You want to put the best show out there. And I don't think there's anyone uh, in the last 75 years, 60 years, I guess he was performing, who, who 
exemplify that. I mean, when he got up on stage, he commanded the stage, the audience. Everybody was watching every movie made. Even when he was off stage, he was the man. I mean, he, he's just such a, you know, if, if you're an entertainer and you want to follow in somebody's footsteps, I can't think of a better guy that you'd want to do it with. The guy was just so in control all the time, it seemed, you know. Do you have, as a performer, because, I mean, if you're going to say, well, I would, like to rec I would like to cover Frank's version of Night and Day, which version do you pick? Do you have a favorite? Because they'll say the same thing about, uh, you know, all kinds of recording artists. Yeah. Oh, I love, Billy Joel is another one that they talk about this way. Yep. Oh, I love the early stuff. Or I like the later stuff. Yep. Do you have an era that you love? Well, you know, I, I do a lot of the Nelson, Nelson Riddle arrangements. Uh, I think one of the reasons there is because it's, it's a little more, uh, it's almost in the middle of the road. It's, you know, uh, some of the earlier stuff, a lot of people may not know the earlier stuff. But the newer arrangements, a lot of people do know that. So I think that's one of the reasons I... Nelson Riddle seems to be my favorite type of arranger anyway for Sinatra songs. Man. Um, tell me about what made you pick the next song you're going to do. Why do you love this one? This next song, the reason I picked this one was it's a rebirth. I mean, it's a, it's a perfect example of Frank Sinatra. You know, this was 1966. He was reinventing himself once more. He had the new album called That's Life. And uh, this song came out. And it just, it was just a kick he needed, Strangers in the Night, and that's life. And it just seemed to put him back in the spotlight uh, on the charts. He was, always, he was always there. People who loved Sinatra were always buying his music. But I think a whole new generation of people uh, really got to hear Frank Sinatra and, and jumped on and said, hey, this guy is great. One more time, one more song for John Malcolm here at Zoomer Radio. Thank you so much. It's so great to be here tonight. That's life. That's life. That's what all the people say. You're riding high in April, shot down in May. But I know I gonna change that tune when I'm back on top back on top in June I said that's life and as funny as it may seem some people get their kicks stomping on a dream but I won't let it I won't let it get me down Cause this final world, it keeps spinning round I've been a puppet, a pauper, a pirate, a poet, a pawn and a king I've been up and down and over and out And I know one thing Each time I find myself laying flat on my face I pick myself up and get back in the race that's life that's life and i can't deny it many's the time i thought of cutting out but my heart won't buy it and if i didn't think it was worth one single try well i'd jump on a big bird then i'd fly well, I've been a puppet, a pauper, a pirate, a poet, a pawn, and a king. I've been up and down and over and out, and I know one thing. Each time I find myself laying flat on my face, I just pick myself up and get back in the race. That's life. That's life. Can't deny it. Many's the time I thought I cut it out, baby. But my heart just ain't gonna buy it. And if there's nothing shaking, come this year, July. Well, I'm gonna roll myself up in a big ball and a die.
best life. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Wow, John Malcolm, ladies and gentlemen. John Malcolm.